Hello, you're with Business Live from BBC News with Rachel Horn and Sally Bundock. This premier in Washington today, amid signs relations may be improving. Social media backlash in Asia with a T-shirt. We'll be live to our bureau in the region for the details. This is a head lower for now. We've had results in from many companies, including EasyJet and news of a CEO departure at Vodafone. Yes, a very warm welcome to the programme and do get in touch with your comments about the fat tax. Keep them clean. We can share them then on air. ZT He was on the agenda last time these met. That was in Beijing at the start of this month. The fate of ZTE will be important to any progress. It was effectively forced out of business limited we will watch those meetings closely thanks Thank you for your time let's have a look now at some other stories in the news in business now the u.s retailer gap has apologized to chinese authorities for selling a t-shirt which showed an incorrect map of the country as they say in london mind the gap let's have a look at markets then in asia you can see japan down slightly from the tokyo stock exchange it made an annual profit of 7.3 billion dollars that's a big turnaround because the previous year they made pretty heavy losses let's look at europe change in management there easyjet shares up three percent they're earning really strong for the first quarter. Johan Lundgren I spoke to earlier. He's the CEO. Uh, that was Joe Miller in New York. Joining us in the studio is Alpesh Patel from Pavilion Partners. Alpesh, thank you for coming Good in. Good morning. Quite some time. He's been there for uh, pretty much a decade. I tell you what's interesting, however, and this doesn't seem to be the reason. Can I ask you, as you're always playing with financial markets on behalf of your clients, what are, what are you doing with oil right now? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we want to be clear on that. Just make that clear. We just want to be absolutely clear. <coughs> interesting, though. Interesting. It is. It's going to be expensive at the pump. We will speak to you later, uh, but still to come up, we're going to be finding out how information about you. Robert says it's obvious that we can't stop ourselves overeating, so I suppose it's a good thing. So many views. The gloves are always off with Alpesh. That's Business Live. We'll see you again tomorrow. Thanks for joining us. Bye-bye.